Greetings, devoted Chiefs enthusiasts. Brace yourselves for another exhilarating Kansas City Chiefs news video today. We've got a crucial update to share, and we urge you to express your support by smashing that like button, subscribing to the channel, and ringing the notification bell to ensure you don't miss a single thrilling moment. In a sensational showdown last Sunday, the Kansas City Chiefs emerged triumphant over the Cincinnati Bengals with a scoreline of 25-17. This victory not only secured their eighth consecutive AFC West title, but also guaranteed them a coveted spot in the playoffs. As the dramatic narratives unfolded last weekend, the Chiefs ultimately secured the third position in the AFC standings. They now find themselves in a captivating scenario heading into Week 18, the culminating week of the regular season. At the onset of the week, Coach Andy Reid dropped a bombshell, revealing that quarterback Patrick Mahomes would be sidelined. In a game essentially devoid of significant implications for standings, it's a prudent decision to preserve a player of Mahomes' caliber. Fast forward to Friday, and the Chiefs unveiled a list of players who will miss the game due to minor injuries and precautionary measures. Among them are notable names like wide receiver Rassi Rice, cornerback Legereus Sneed, wideout Kadarius Toney, and tackle Donovan Smith. Notably, Rice was on the cusp of a milestone, just 62 yards away from reaching 1,000 receiving yards in his rookie season. Adding to the suspense, five more players were listed as questionable for the game on Friday, running back Isaiah Pacheco, linebacker Nick Bolton, cornerback Trent McDuffie, and defensive ends George Karloftes and Mike Dana. This contingent plays a pivotal role in the team's playoff aspirations, making it judicious to afford them a week of rest. Yet, the anticipation intensifies with the absence of any designation for two superstar players on Friday, defensive tackle Chris Jones and tight end Travis Kelsey. Speculation has been rife in Chiefs' kingdom about whether Jones and Kelsey will take the field for this game. Ordinarily, in such scenarios, it would be a given for Reed to rest these stalwarts and ensure their readiness for the playoffs. However, the plot thickens as both players stand on the brink of significant milestones. Should Jones record half a sack or more in the final game, it triggers a staggering $1.25 million incentive bonus. Meanwhile, Kelsey eyes a milestone of his own. 16 receiving yards during the game would secure 1,000 receiving yards for him for the eighth consecutive season. Only 17 receivers in NFL history have achieved such a feat. Kelsey could be the first tight end to claim this distinction, doubling the accomplishments of other elite tight ends in their careers. For Jones, this represents a culmination of efforts since renegotiating his contract, compensating for the missed first game during negotiations. With playoff incentives still on the horizon, Jones is likely to capitalize early in the game before getting a well-deserved rest. Reed is expected to grant Jones the opportunity to hit his incentive before benching him for the remainder of the game. As for Kelsey, it's a quest to etch his name in the annals of football history. This milestone not only adds to his personal legacy, but elevates the Chiefs and their place among the greatest players in the game. Already among the greats, Kelsey seeks to reach another stratosphere. Similarly to Jones, it's reasonable to assume that Reed will afford Kelsey the chance to attain his milestone early in the game before taking his seat on the bench. Kelsey's stellar performance against the Chargers in the past, with 12 receptions and 179 yards, suggests he might achieve this feat in the first series of the game before resting for the playoffs. While a football game awaits, not everyone will enjoy a day off. However, it's a logical move for Reed to rest key contributors, given the guaranteed playoff berth. The Chiefs won't ascertain their playoff opponent until the Buffalo Bills face the Miami Dolphins on Sunday night football. The Bills' outcome could either position them for the top two spots with a win or eliminate them from the playoffs with a loss. If the Pittsburgh Steelers overcome the Baltimore Ravens, resting starters, and the Jacksonville Jaguars upset the Tennessee Titans, this complex scenario unfolds. The Chiefs could potentially face the Dolphins, Bills, Houston Texans, Indianapolis Colts, or Steelers. Regardless of the opponent, a home game awaits, with a high probability of playing their first playoff game away from home in the Mahomes era. 
anticipate an electrifying spectacle as Jones and Kelsey aim for their milestones, potentially exiting early to spectate from the sidelines. In the grand scheme, whether it's a victory or defeat, what matters most is witnessing players with extended playing time striving to etch their names into Chiefs history. Revel in every moment this team bestows upon us, including the inevitable scoreboard watching that awaits.